dalawang linggo na nga ang nakaraan, simula nang maaresto ang isang pilantropo na si Francis Leo Marcos, at marami na ring lumabas na mga isyo o kaso na pinukukul sa kanya, marami ring lumabas na mga naninira at pilit siyang pabagsakin, sa kabila ng kanyang ginagawa na pagtulong sa mga mahihirap nating mga kababayan, sa gitna ng COVID crisis. Pero hindi mo rin may kakaila na marami ring sumusuporta at nagmamahal sa kanya. Nitong nakaraang araw lang, ay biglang nagpahayag ng saloobi ng isang lalaki sa pangalang David Ilaga na isang producer at director ng isang indie film sa Amerika. At ito ang kanyang naging pahayag. Ang chismosong, ang chismosong NBI, Vic Lorenzo, taga Green Meadows ka pala, inutil ka. Ikaw may kagagawa nito, pinagkaisahan nyo si Francis Leo Marcos. Inciting to sedition. in social class. Bakit? nag ba sa mga mayayama si Francis Leo Marcos? Inciting to sedition in social class to dispar, to disturb the public. He's only encouraging kung sino yung mayayama na kapitbahay kung gusto niyong tumulong. There is no inciting to sedition. Chismosong NBI ka. Gawin mo trabaho mo. pinilit mong i-convict si Francis Leo Marcos. Anong klaseng NBI ka? Kaya pala kinukutsaba mo yung mga journalist na bias. Panayang interview mo sa mga bias na journalist. Mga i, kung ayaw kong magmura. Anak ng tetay ang punyemas kayo, inutil. Akalaan mo yan, taga Green Meadows ka pala eh. Tapos sasabihin mo, inciting to si Edison in social class. Do you know what is that mean? Huh? Inciting to inflict an act of hate against the rich. Did you see any hate from Francis Leo Marcos to hate his neighborhood? He never provoked anything to be inside to sedition. This person, Mr. Francis Leo Marcos, chismosong NBI ka talaga. Akalaan mo, broadcast in the radio, broadcast anywhere, dahil cybercrime ka, cybercrime unit, that's bullshit. Inciting to sedition in social class. There are several forms of the crime of sedition. Under of the revised penal code, one of which is to rise public, publicly and tumultuously. by means of force, intimidation, or by other means outside of legal methods to inflict any act of hate and revenge against private person or any social class or despoil any person of his property for any social end. I never seen any hate from Mr. Francis Leo Marcos when he do the video into this neighborhood. He is the residence of Green Meadows. He has right to do because he is paying the dues of his communities where he used to live there in Green Meadows. So you are one of the officer of your community in the Green Meadows. That's why pinagkaisahan nyo si Francis Leo Marcos, sasabihin mo pa, social class, inciting to sedition. I haven't seen any hate from Mr. Francis Leo Marcos to his neighborhood. He never provoked anybody into his neighborhood. He just only encouraged people if they can help to this pandemic crisis of COVID-19. to help the community. Masama ba yun? Ngayon, pinagkaisahan nyo. Chismosong NBI ka. You should be out of your practice. Napaka-chismoso mo, tatawagan mo lahat ang radio broadcaster ng puro mga bayas. Inutil kayo. Anak ng teteng. Punyemas kayo. Akalain mo yun? Taga Green Meadows ka pala? So, akalain mo yun? Itong chismosong NBI na ito pala, taga Green Meadows. Anak ng kamote, oh. 
Kaya pala pinipilit mo inciting to sedition in social class. Implic and hate against to the rich people. I never see any hate from Mr. Francis Leo Marcos. He only encourages, oh, yung mga mayayaman dyan, gising kayo, pwede ba kayong tumulong? That is not disturbing the public. And whatever he do, he did not even disturb the government for giving away what he wants to give to the people. Please go back to your school. What is the inciting to sedition? Against rich, if he did not even revenge, wala siyang kagalit. There is nothing sight inciting to sedition about the social class. Anong klaseng NBI ka? Chismoso. You supposed to be the chief of chismosong NBI. Ikaw na yung pinaka-chismosong NBI. Tatawagan mo yung mga bias na journalists, mga bias kayo, mga leche, inutil. Mga inutil kayo, anak ng teteng, punyemas. Hindi nyo ba alam ang ginagawa nyo? Pinagkaisahan nyo yung tao. Kayo pala may gawa niyan eh. Tapos sasabihin nyo, a lot of crimes, prove it! Inciting to, to sedition. He never have a hate from his personality to hate his neighborhood. He only encourages the neighborhood to help if they can. And if you cannot give a help, just shut the fuck up. No bells, mock mock. Hello, hello everyone. Shout out to each and everyone. So, kaya ikaw, Chief NBI Cybercrime Unit, Division of NBI National Bureau of Investigation, how scum you are. You degrade what is the NBI. You degrade who you are. Inciting to sedition in social class. I never see. Prove it. If Mr. Francis Leo hate his neighborhood. He pay his dues and he has right to go around to his neighborhood because he is the resident of this St. Green Pedos Ridge subdivision. You do not have right to condemn who, whoever the residents of that subdivision. And he never mentioned any name. As I see and review the video, he never mentioned any name of whoever residents of that subdivision. There is no such inciting to sedition that you will keep talking about. Inciting to sedition in social class. Fuck you all. Social class. Kaya na mga mahihirap, ganun ba? Dahil naiinggit kayo. Dahil si Mr. Francis Leo Marcos lang ang pwedeng tumulong, siya lang ang nakagawa niyan sa buong mundo. I admire this person for being he is. And whatever case you put in him, that is your story to make. You degrade the NBI, Mr. Big Lorenzo. Kaya pala lahat ng mga interview mo, puro mga bias. Puro mga bias na reporter. Mga journalist, ika nga. Pero mga bias, ikay, lahat kayo, inutil anak ng teteng punyemas. Akalain mo yan, taga Green Meadows ka pala. So, sa Green Meadows, kayo ang may pangkanaan yan. Kung sino man ang mayayama sa Green Meadows, man, hindi nyo dapat gawin niya sa isang taong tumutulong. Dapat ay magpasalamat pa kayo. Dahil merong isang Francis Leo Marcos na tumutulo sa kanyang mga kababayan kahit mga frontliners mga police officers binibigyan niya ng pagkain ikaw NBI na chismoso may ibinigay ka ba sa mga frontliners? bakit hindi kita tatawagin chismoso? you know that is the confidential information under your custody ipangangalandakan mo o oh, hindi kanya yung bahay hindi kanya yung sasakyan that is a gossiping Dapat hindi ka nag-NBI, dapat naging reporter ka din na chismoso. That is a very confidential 
kahit pa naka under custody of the NBI in your in your custody you don't have no rights to disclose to whoever what is the status of this person under your custody unless he is under oath into the court in the front of the judge and you have no rights I don't care if you're the NBI you degrade the NBI and I'll tell you again the fingerprinting of Mr. Francis Marcos has been in the NBI since when he got the passport and now you retake the fingerprinting of him what is that for? what kind of National Bureau of Investigation you have and what kind of cybercrime unit you have You don't understand what is the inciting to citizen in social class. He never disturbed the public to revenge his hate because he never been hate. I never seen to this person that he hates his neighborhood or anyone. Every each and every one of you are the one who hates Mr. Francis Leo Marcos. What kind of National Bureau of Investigation. Man, nakakainit kayo ng ulo. Pinagkakaisahan yung tao. That is not right. Dahil ba komo na mas maganda yung isang pilantropo, pinainan nyo lahat ng kung ano ikakaso nyo. Lahat ng kaso, ilagay nyo patong-patong. Pero I don't buy it. Like I'm telling you, I am not the supporter of Francis Leo Marcos. I have nothing to do with this person. But I admire him for his advocacy, giving help to the community. Hindi nyo ba maintindihan yun? Yun nga binibigyan ng gobyerno, ninanakaw pa ng mga ibang taong nasa gobyerno, mga barangay tanod, kapitan, even mayor. Even congressman, aminin ninyo yan. Hindi nawawala yan sa lipunan ng gobyerno, mga korupsyon. Tapos ngayon, may isang taon lumabas, nainggit kayo, gagawa nyo na kung ano-ano, ichichismis ninyo. Hindi pa ba prove nyo na namigay siya ng ilang tonilad ng bigas para lang makalipas ang paghihirap ng ating mga kababayang nangangailangan? Anong klaseng puso meron kayo? Ha? Huh? Big Lorenzo, isipin mo yung ginawa mo. 